Not all of Escobar's hippos remain at the hacienda. At great cost, two of them were transported to the Medellin Zoo, where they are popular with visitors. One of the hippos, named Orion, is in need of a little special attention. He has a cavity and needs a filling. Dentist Ivan Bono will perform the procedure. We clean the teeth and then we fill it up. Now we are going to replace a little bit the, the, this, this cement. Almost. Luckily, Orion has been around humans for 10 years, so the danger is minimal. This is the tooth. This is the broken incisor. The idea is to avoid the infection. Still, any time you work around a hippo, the possibility of something going wrong is always there. The operation is a success, and this captive hippo is ready for viewing once again. It begs a question from the locals. Why not capture more of the hippos and take them to other zoos across the area? Problem is resources. Hippos are very difficult to maintain, very expensive to transport. So it was a matter of, of that we couldn't find a place to relocate these individuals that are outside of Hacienda Napoles. It is virtually impossible to find new homes for the hippos in Colombia with such limited funds and manpower. As we have seen, even in their African homeland, transporting these animals from location to location is often a difficult proposition. Peter Fisher and the wildlife relocation team in Zambia are now trying a more elaborate hippo capture plan. After the failed river catch, they opt for a helicopter darting. Yeah, you hold the gun, I'll you have a bit of drift. Darting hippo has always been a no-no because that dart and that initial disturbance sends them straight back to the water. Then you've got an immobilized animal that's going to drown. So for that, we've got to now look at different drug combinations that are still going to keep that breathing reflex responsive and, and so that you don't have a dead, dead animal at the end of the day. The safety of the hippo is only half the equation. The well-being of the transport team is the other half. It might not look like it, but believe me, I'm scared the whole time. Because you know, any wrong move from that animal, you're dealing with over a ton of weight. <laughs> and it's got big, long tusks and teeth. Believe me, that thing is going to make, going to bite you in half, eh? He's going to really hurt you. So you've got to have your wits about you the whole time. <laughs> 